Do you like true crime stories? Does investigating unsolved mysteries interest you? Do conspiracy theories intrigue you? Then this is the channel for you. Hi, I'm your true crime psychic medium, Dee Sparta. Life isn't all love, light, and sunshine. Here we dive into the shadows and reveal what is hidden in the darkness. This is True Crime Terror. Please remember to subscribe to this channel and like the video down Hey, it's me, Dee. Welcome. How are you doing today? I guess I'm doing okay myself. Thank you. Um, today I... Okay, so I says like I'm never doing another one of these readings. Josh Duggar, I'm going back. There's been some interesting stuff coming up. Anna is expecting their seventh child, right? It's the seventh. I forget sometimes. Um and there's been issues with the people that Josh is staying with, apparently the wife is very uncomfortable around Josh. And it's making things harder when Anna tries to come and visit with the kids. So, you know, there's tension. Um, we do know that the show Counting On has been canceled. I can only imagine if the Duggars are going to try and find someone else to try and pick them up for a show or come up with something. I don't know. Um, but that was their main, you know, income coming in and Jim Bob would pass it out to the family. So without it, you know, yeah. <laughs> and Josh was working, but now he can't, isn't, but he used to be working at a auto dealership. So it's got to be really stressful for poor Anna right now. And she apparently is trying to believe that Josh is innocent. And in the court case, things have come out where um, Josh's attorneys, they wanted to get pictures of Josh's hands and feet removed that had been taking, taken when he was being booked. And apparently it's because Josh has a scar. I even have a scar on my hand. I don't know if you can really see it here, but well, right in here. Nasty. And here, I've had surgery. <laughs> but um, he has one on his hand, I think right, right in here. And apparently, they didn't want these pictures to be used. And the judge did rule on this. And it's, you know, they were like, they can use them. Because apparently, <laughs> photos on Josh's phone that are of child yes uh the p word um that he claimed he didn't put there aren't his had that they have his hands they have hands on there that have that scar and i think they're going to try and match it and say see this is that's that's a little that's pretty damning <laughs> if you ask me i'm glad that they do have that kind of evidence um and apparently he was said that he wasn't one day at the dealership where stuff had been downloaded. But apparently he was. And that's come out proof that, you know. So he's there, there's been a lot of shady stuff going on with Josh. And the trial's coming up. And I, I'm curious what's going to happen. I mean, I am worried about the victims of Josh's. I'm worried about his wife and kids. I care. You know, I Josh, I, I, I could care less about, to be honest. I, you know, he's a piece of shit. But, you know, having been stuck in a marriage with someone who was just a piece of shit, I understand where I felt trapped at some point in, like, alone. So, I guess I kind of, like, I'm worried about Anna. I hope she can recover from this. And, you know, she was just, she was raised in this um, cult and 
her whole thing is she's a stay-at-home mom. She doesn't work because that's what her husband's supposed to do, and she's supposed to pop out them babies. She's been popping out them babies, and now she's alone. And that has got to be scary. Well, uh, everything here is all alleged and for entertainment purposes only. I don't, I'm not going to do, you know, that how I will give a little brief summary and then go into details and then do a reading. Because this is the third time I am doing a reading on this family, I don't think I really, you know, I just, we just got caught up. There is plenty, plenty of stations, uh, channels, the stations news stations too that are all discussing this case you can find it everywhere okay but we want to look into see kind of the mindset the things things are changing and i think the game plan is changing with the family how they're going to handle situations the whole jim bob and michelle and their family because their family is also affected by all of this and it's got to be scary <laughs> all right so we're just Hop right over to the tarot reading now. See you there. Hi. Hey. Welcome back. Let's get into this tarot reading. Please remember that this is all alleged and for entertainment purposes only. And we are, we are dealing with a very sensitive subject. Um, Josh Duggar has been accused of some very serious, disgusting despicable crimes um so let's get into the cards i'm using the haunted mansion tarot deck again today already got the king of cups all right hmm okay the Six of Cups. We've got some cups. A lot of emotions coming around. Coming out. Whoa. <laughs> Here's another card. Okay. Huh. Let's see here. The King of Cups. Passing things down. Looking for hope, but this king is very selfish. He's not willing to give. I think Jim Bob is trying to control things with Anna. And I think it's a lot of emotional kind of hurt and abuse we're dealing with here. Her Because Josh is gone, it's kind of like trying to put a guilt trip on her that she should have helped and been better. That's, that's really disturbing to me. <laughs> um, and... She's trying to hang on to hope. She's praying. She's like, if there is a God, please. I'm alone with these kids and I'm pregnant. I want to believe my husband. And Jim Bob is pretty much feeding um, ho false hope into her. And basically, if you stand by him, I'll help take care of you. Um, hmm, yeah, here's the Magician Reversed, right over that cold-hearted king, and the money, not willing to let go, not willing to let go, yeah, so, the Magician Reversed, you know, I always call him, he's my sneaky little guy, um, he's basically trying to cover up everything he's trying to cover his own tracks and there's a lot there's a there's a money trail here you know you look at here's the uh ace of pentacles and there they have a trail of money 
and here is here's the fiery queen of wands i think Anna's trying to look to some other woman for help. Um, there is a woman in her life. I don't know if it's a sister, a Duggar sister, or one of her own family. But they're trying to speak to her the truth. Yeah, okay. It's the Three of Wands. Mm -hmm. This is you reap what you sow. And Jim Bob's been sowing some bad shit. And then, you know, we have... Okay, so this is... Okay. This here is reverse. It's temperance. There is an extreme impatience. They want to get this case done with. I think the mindset here... Well, actually... They want to just sweep it all away um, because it's hindering their finances. Yeah, bound, eight of swords. Everything's tied up. Anna's bound to them because she doesn't have anything now. I mean, everything was Josh's. And, you know, she might also be afraid of losing her children, of them being taken away. She's has no control right now of her life and extremely powerless. She's stuck in the situation she doesn't want to be in. And I, I am so sorry, Anna, darling. I am. I hope you can find that hope. Okay, so... Alrighty, here is the Knight of Cups. Oh, I think... That's a little weird. Because he's all a little Mr. Romance. And adventure. But he's also kind of like he's daring to go on things. But what is Mr. Romance doing here? And the Nine of Swords. Which. It being reversed is. Okay, now I get that guy and the martyrdom here. It's like, I'm a, I am, yeah, and there's going to be an ending of a marriage. Okay, so, <laughs> yeah, there is, um, Josh is trying to play the victim. I'm the victim here. And Anna, you should have been doing better. If you were a better God, more godly woman, then I wouldn't have been falling. This wouldn't have happened. Mm. It's going to push a divide. There's going to be... A splitting of a marriage. And I think it's going to be Josh and Anna. It's not going to come... Right now, that is a part, technically, but something's going to come up that's going to push her to that edge. Um, the Seven of Swords, trying to find that way out. Hold on. That's over the gut. Da. What is Josh doing? No, Josh, don't do it. Don't, 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 don't do this. This is the upset. This is, he's frustrated. He wants to, he needs to get going. He wants to get out. He is, oh my gosh. I think they have finances hidden. And I think he's going to try and make a run. Or he's, these are things he's thinking about. I could just get away. He believes the church, the God is going to protect him that, you know, through all this, here's the Hierophant, you know, and oh, that's a bunch of corruptness here, but it's all about, he's got, you know, tradition with his family. He's going to try and get away though. He, he wants to run. He wants to get, just run and disappear. Mm-hmm. Okay, the Queen of Swords reversed. 
Now, <laughs> it's a bad idea. <laughs> Some his hand is pretty much saying, "Don't do that. Don't run. It's a bad idea." Here's the King of Swords, and he is um, manipulating and trying to tell her, "No, I've got to do this." And here is the um, Page of Wands. Oh gosh, that's a fiery upside down mess of lack of. There's a, such a immaturity going on here with Josh. I'm getting a sense he's never fully like matured as an adult. He's kind of like trapped in his mind back as a child or a teenager. Where, you know, mommy and daddy could take care of everything and cover everything up for him. And he doesn't have to take responsibility. Yeah, here's the trip. See, he's going. He He's, he's, gonna tr he's planning a trip. That's the chariot there. And the chariot. Uh, the queen of pentacles. Upside down. He feels he's being treated unreasonably by the justice, the court system. This is all, this is not my fault. And the two of swords, he's got a decision he's coming to that is kind of difficult for him. Um, I think he's trying to decide if he can just run or stay put. He's, it's, he's, he's full of a lot of swirling chaos. And, and the people don't want him still at the house where he's at. Jib Bob is pretty much... Forcing that to happen. It's being forced. They're overwhelmed also. We got the Six of Wands. They, uh, you, you see the woman, she's trapped and surrounded by all of these fiery people. Woo -woo -woo. Um, usually, it's they're trying to get away here in this picture, but they think that... There's really a sense of, I am great. I am good. I have saw this success in my life. See, I have a wife and I have my family and I'm following the footsteps of my parents and such. But, hmm. Yeah. And we have the um, Page of Pentacles. And this is, you know, not, not spending, using money wisely. Um, just, yeah, this really immature with the finances. I wonder if that Anna and Josh are having financial issues um, not able to live off of what they're being given. Okay, so here's the hermit reverse. And little hermit boy here. This. Yeah, it's isolation. Josh is, can't handle being isolated. He needs to be out. He He's trying to tell everyone I'm not going to survive in jail. I am not going to be able to even stay housebound here. I need to get out. He is so set right now with this whole mind of escaping, getting free, being liberated. Um, he just, he wants out. Excuse me, I got to turn on a fan. I am really hot in this house room. Huh. I got lights and candles and I'm like, <sighs> yet I'm drinking hot coffee. I know, I know, folks. Okay, I'm going to grab a different deck right now. Let's see here. Ooh. I haven't used Dark Mirror in a while. And then I want to try something different. And you'll see. Okay. Purple cars. Yeah. A triumph of lies. Jim Bob has done so much lying and deceit. It's he's trying to yeah, naked before the stars. He's trying to hide everything because of Josh's mistake, she's being revealed also. He's feeling very overly exposed and afraid that... Oh, the church is mad too. They're like, you were supposed to be 
here, see, I won't cry for you. That's the church. They, you, you, they're like, you are our example. Our, you know, we could show that this is good. What we're doing is right. And yet now you're falling and they're not going to stand by them anymore. Today for tomorrow, that just wanting to get past this, they think, is this me? No, I'm not really like this. I need to get, once we get past the scandal, once court's over and they really believe Josh is going to be found not guilty, but I don't see that happening. And I'm not sure what I'm seeing happening. Okay, gilded regret, trapped, caged up, regret. Yeah, this is a, this is the, this is a Jim Bob, Michelle, and Josh <laughs> in here um feeling very vulnerable trying to wonder how they're going to pick themselves back up there is a false hope that jim bob is telling the rest of the family and they are so used to believing everything that jim bob says that yeah let me see does that fit in? Yeah, okay that looks fine right yeah, I got some charms here. Let me... Ah! Don't want to... Got charms, charms everywhere. Let's see here. I want to see if I can learn anything else. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I have to look at this and I'll put it back under. Okay, Cancer. Okay, cards. Money. Okay. Um. Okay, if you could see these ones here. Now, let's see. Um, trying to. There's communication issue going on here. Yeah. Someone's going to come out with more information. I don't want to say what it is, though. But I think there's more victims. And that, that hurts me. <laughs> that hurts my soul here. Um... Um, the deck, you know, the, the, you know, the card symbols here. Okay. They're going to come out with information and they think it's going to, um, they're being strategic to try and with their money and working. Is there... One of the doers a cancer. That's 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 where I'm like, I don't know any of their signs, folks. And I wish I did. But somebody who's a cancer who's got is gonna come out with a message and it's gonna come across very strategic, very forced, kinda like they're wanting you to believe this narrative. And money was switching hands. I believe Josh was selling pictures and making an income that way. I do believe Jim Bob knew of this. I am kind of really freaked out about that. Let me see here. Yeah. Okay, so the chair. What's this guy here? Oh, a teapot. We got the tea. We got the tea here, folks. <laughs> An angel and a monkey. Okay. Um, they are trying to protect protect here's the angel protect josh um but 
they're trying to come up with a plan to protect Josh and try and point it you know, on other people or other influences. I think even if he's found guilty, it's going to be to the family. They're going to try and do this narrative of Josh is the victim. He's the martyr. And we need to just sit, be patient, and just accepting of what's happened. And I really don't think that's a good idea. But... <sighs> Okay, I see someone being invited over. A politician. Someone in politics is stepping in. And giving... <laughs> monkey. Really bad, bad advice. It's not... not. I would say... You know, just monkeying around. I think. Yeah. There is something going in the background. I think Josh was part of a ring. I think other people are afraid of Josh revealing more. And they're trying to be patient, wait to see how much do they really have on Josh and anyone else. Because it's outside, I think, it's outside the family of, well, Josh and Anna's family directly, but Jim Bob and his friends or maybe an in-law cousin or something they're um, involved very much so I think their money is stopped coming in not just from TLC but they had to stop what Josh was doing with the pictures and this exchanging of funds it couldn't happen anymore because they got they, they, they realized the eyes on them and that's putting a lot of pressure and a lot of fear. As these are just what I'm sensing. Um, when it comes to the actual Josh hitting the trial, it's just blank. And that tells me that more events are to come before... We're going to get, can see what's going to happen or it's not going to happen. And it's not a good reason. I'll just say that. Um, yeah, I think we'll just end this little reading here. I hope you appreciate it. I have some other ones planned, but you know, we got sidetracked because of some news and some information and cases like with Britney Spears and this case with Josh they are very relevant. This is, you know, Josh is a criminal. Um, and it's on here. You reap what you sow. You know, you just been tossing in weeds and rocks. That's you, you're not going to get anything good. Nope, nada. Oh, okay. This one wasn't as heavy or as dark as some of the past ones that I've dealt with. I guess because I wasn't really in on the victims and I didn't get too into Josh's mind. I, I, I protected myself because that's, he's, he's a dark, controlling, scary motherfucker. That smile is, ooh, ooh, I hate it. Anyway, folks, <laughs> please remember, comment down below. I know I'm having more and more new subscribers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Remember that once I do hit, was it 2,000 um, subscribers, I will be offering um, to five subscribers. We'll have a chance to win um, a one question tarot reading live. I will do. And uh, yeah, so share this. 
get and if you haven't subscribed already but you keep coming back just subscribe hit the notification bell so you know when i'm posting again and hit the like button comment with your ideas what you think what's going on with the duggars um you can even let me know because i like i said i don't follow them it's just a lot with the whole family i didn't follow them before i never watched the show so there's things that you know i'm not as familiar with but i'd love to hear if there's anything that i've said that has resonated with what you know please let me know comment down below with that also with other ideas of other readings that you would like to see um whether it be true crime and an unsolved mystery paranormal experience just let me know and i will be posting another poll on the community page keep an eye over there also so you can vote now remember everybody be kind to yourself be kind to others i love you see you next time bye